I'm still trying to figure out where the fuck you're going. I don't know. Probably trying to do the surrounding. I'm going that way. I don't know what's down that way. Silver cat ring, Chris. Yeah, oh, Chris. Never mind. Fuck it. <laughs> Chris, you should de equip your Estus Flask, because you're taking less fall damage. You don't need that shit. No. Hell yeah, hell yeah, hell yeah dude. Pristine logic. I mean, Hell, I'm at it. Why don't I just unequip all my stuff so I can dodge better? Hell yeah! That's the logic we use in this team speak, apparently. I mean, you can do quick rolls now if you do that. By the way, this is how you got into that that uh, tomb. There you go. Yeah. Yeah, but I didn't come up that way, like that way that that yeah. guy's firing from. I don't know what down, what down, down there. I think there's some items. Come on, I need you to come down here so that I can fight. We're at 58 dexterity, boys. <laughs> like the priorities for Dex are just so straightforward. So the priorities are strength. What the fuck are you talking about? The fuck? Hell no. You gotta is. get like strength shit weighs a fuck ton, so you gotta go for vitality and shit. You don't gotta do that shit for Dex. Fucking heavy shit takes more stamina to swing, so you gotta level up more into the endurance as well. You get your points spread out a lot fucking harder in strength builds. Not that bad. I mean, my points are pretty spread too. So you have 30, 30 bigger. Why do you have 30 bigger? So I don't get one shot. Wait, bigger is HP. Right? Yeah. Okay, yeah. So that that's fine. Everyone, HP and Dex is pretty much all I have leveled and up on Dex. Dex will win. And have endurance. And endurance, I got the 30. I left it there. Yeah. Good to Sullivan. If you don't need this way, you can go back. There's nothing up here anymore. Wait, what was this way? That is how you get to Ponta Sullivan. That's how you get. Remember in Ponta Sullivan near the bonfire, there was a, like uh, a lever? And that looked like a way to like yeah. go up and down. Yeah, that's where this leads to. If you keep going uh... the way you came out from, you'll get to that area. Really? Like, it, this isn't fucking rocket science. I just exactly thought this was the way to. from Bontif's bonfire. Wait, you just go wait, left wait, and wait, go wait. up instead. Wait, you didn't know this? I, I did not. Yeah. Uh -huh. Mostly 
mostly because I don't think this is useful. Nice. It, it doesn't change the fact that that's where it exactly fucking leads to. Huh. Well, shit. There's also a chest over there. Up on the upper level. There's also a crystal lizard. Yeah, no, I've never been in here. That's a lift. Huh. So what is this, like an alternative way to go to Kaponta for someone? No, it's just the way, so... The game doesn't want you to actually go through, like, the game shows you the courtyard of the giants, it doesn't want you to go through the courtyard of the giants, though, on your first run because of the two enemies that hold, like, waited for you, the NPCs. There's a, there's a separate, if you go all the way to the left, there's a little ladder, uh, well, sorry, ladder, stairs, that lead up to where those fucking, uh, pyromancers are throwing fire at you, and the game is trying to say, like, kill these pyromancers, and then that leads to the, uh, at least see the lift right there, after you kill them all, or the most of them. It, the lift isn't really important though, like, it's, you're really just going up there for that fucking chest. I think that's a weapon. Yeah, it's a golden ritual sphere. <laughs> I don't even think it's that good. Wait, that still fucking hit it? I don't know, man. A big AoE. Um, otherwise, yeah, that's about it. Um, there is a chest you missed that isn't too hard to get to. Where, in that room? No, if you go out to where you came from, there should be a, stair a set of stairs. If you go down those stairs, into the room... Yep, you see him. In the back, of, in this room now, there's gonna be like an area that leads to the back area. To see enemies breathing. They're the hidden enemies from... Yeah, I noticed. Yeah, back there there's a, there's a chest of items. I don't know what, I don't know what it is though. I know there's something right there though. Dark Sun, it's not too good. It's something. Oh, it's a damage reduction ring. I don't know, man. You could use that against Aldrich. Or well, that or the Snow or the Flame one. Aldrich has fire damage? Yeah, in her second, for second phase, she has like a fire after effect. damage you can reduce, but I don't use any damage reduction rings anyway. Once it's like a physical damage ring. I know the area. I'm gonna be honest, I've never really spent that much time on Aldrich. I've never even lost to Aldrich. Hell yeah. I think that's the only Dark Souls boss I can say that about. Cause I lost the fucking back to hit the Judicator, whatever. Iudex. The, the very first boss. That guy whapped the shit out of me in the beginning. Yeah, he did. Once I figured out you could parry him, it wasn't too bad, but. Fuck parrying in the beginning of a Dark Souls run. If you're so bad in the beginning, parry just got awful. Yeah, I'm trying to parry at the very start for real. I, I don't like the direction they took parry in this one. What do you mean? Uh, in the first one and the second one, you can parry without repercussion. You just parry and it, it negates an attack. In this one, if your shield's, you know, not 100% block and shit, you still take the, like, reduced damage. So, Covenants, Chris. And Orlando! Why not, 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 not. Oh my god. Oh my god, that's a goddamn aggressive. You <laughs> jump off the edge. That's a Didn't jump, but you got shot in the ass. So, you know where those dogs were, Chris? Hmm? Um, 
down there is where you do the Aldrich Faithful Covenant. It's also a uh, bonfire area. Down there with the dogs. No, to the side. Oh, wait, no. No, I got nothing. Aren't you going to get your souls? I mean... The giant ass really rat things. That just run down. Why, why don't... Oh, why don't, why don't you just yeah, teleport yeah. to the pontiff thing and then just run from there? Because there's gonna be less enemies. Huh. Yeah, okay. There's gonna be less harder enemies. I forgot pontiff had a bonfire. Remember, remember I was talking about the shortcut to him? Nifty little elevator I never knew about. Serpentine! Serpentine! I don't know if you just serpentine. Oh, I don't think Dragon was there for that one. I didn't have it recorded. So maybe start recording Diablo. Circle strafe. Okay, there's the puppers. Alright, so what about the puppers? Well, if you kill both of them, it spawns a bonfire down there. Okay, dragon saying crazy things. Here's the thing you do back here. And before you get too close to an edge and get shot in the ass again. That wouldn't happen a second time, would it? You mean a third time? A second time, would it? How many times have you been shot in the ass and flown off a cliff? Did I miss some? Is there like some protected memories going on here? Yes. And that just leads me back to where I was. Okay. There's not like any way closer than what I just took. Get down to the damn dogs. Huh? I mean, I just go out of Pontiff to get to the dogs faster. Yep, that's what I thought. You don't gotta do the dogs, Chris. You're not gonna join that covenant, so that bonfire is pretty much useless to you. Blue dragon. Blue dragon, I wanna kill the rat. Or we're like, okay, man. I mean, I did the same thing, I can't really argue, but... Yeah, just don't lose your souls, bro. Hmm? No, I'm not gonna do that anyways, don't you worry. What? Wait, what is critical? Uh, it's where is you that... backstab them and or do a frontal, uh, 
Visceral attack. Is that luck? Yes, it scales off luck, I believe. Um, okay. Why? I was trying to jam my weapon. Uh, critical is just a base 100 for everyone. There should be no reason you can't enchant that weapon. Um, that's actually really weird. Too greedy. 